your students phys next uh, example 10 chapter number 24 physics for scientists and engineers in college so point charge equi potential surfaces so for a single point charge q so we have a point charge q that has value 4 in 10 power minus 9 coulombs get the equipotential surface are line in the plane so the potential is 10 volt so v1 is equal to 10 volts so we need to find the uh, equipotential surface so as we know that potential v is inversely proportional to the distance we just determine the distance r so r1 so v1 is equal to k q1 over r1 so r1 is equal to v1 uh, r1 is equal to r1 is equal to k one minute r1 is equal to k k q1 over v1 so the r1 is equal to k is 90 to 10 to the power 9 q1 charge is 4 into 10 to the power minus 9 coulomb so instead of uh, q1 we can write simply q so the r1 it becomes the distance becomes uh, divided by the potential is 10 volt so the, the r1 is equal to 3.6 meter so this distance 3.6 so from the 3.6 meter 3.6 meter this is r1 that is equal to 3.6 meter so for example this is a point so we draw a line we draw a circle we draw a circle so this is not the correct circle i have to redraw the circle one minute one minute so this is for example 3.6 3.6 meter i have to draw the same circle around this 3.6 3.6 and 3.6 here we have to attach we have to attach using the protector or anything that has the exact circle uh, i am unable to draw on the from this uh, writing pad this is very difficult but you have to draw the circular path so any point on this line on this surface this circle has the same potential that is 10 volt 10 volt similarly we will find have to find the potential uh, v2 is 20 volt you have to another find but you have to find another potential uh, that is 20 volt so in order to find the distance r2 we use the same formula so r2 is equal to k q over k q over v2 so k is 9 to 10 power 9 charge is uh, 4 into 10 to the power minus 9 divided by v2 is 20 volt so the r2 is equal to we get 1.8 meter so 1.8 is the half of the, this one half of this distance so at exactly half of this distance we draw another if you potential so you use your protector or anything that has exactly the circular path so this is another uh, if you potential surface second one so if you took any point on this surface it will have the same potential that is the 20 volt and the last one r3 so in order to draw the uh, third one the potential r3 so we need to distance r3 k q over v3 so k is 9 to 10 power 9 q is uh, same 4 into 10 to the power minus 9 minus 9 and divided by we divide with the 30 volt so that the r3 is equal to 1.2 meter so r distance is 1.2 meter so 1.2 is second one is uh, one uh, 1.8 and third one is 1.2 1.2 is something here so we have to draw another circle with 1.2 radii so that all the points on this circle having radii of 1.2 having the distance from this center because the charge q is at the center so at the 1.2 this is first uh, first equipotential that is equal to 10 uh, 30 volt sorry 31 the blue one is the 30 volt potential so the first potential equipotential surface is the red one that has potential of uh, 10 volt 10 volt the second potential surface is that has the green one that has a 20 volt potential this one every every point on this green one it has a 20 volt and the blue one it has 30 volt on all the points on the surface so equipotential surfaces are